A particular breed of a fish has its weight W in kilograms related to its length L in meter, modeled by the function W is equal to 2 times 10 to the power of negative 2 L squared. Find the inverse of the function and find the approximate length of a single fish if its weight is 900 grams. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to understand the problem. So the weight and the length are related in a particular breed of fish and its relationship can be modeled by the function w is equal to 2 times 10 to the power of negative 2 l squared. So that's the that's the function. So find the inverse of the function and we're going to find the approximate length of the fish if its weight is 900 grams. So based on this function if the given is weight we can find the length f and f the given is length, we can also find the, the weight. So the first thing we're going to do is find the inverse. So we're just going to copy the function w is equal to 2 times 10 to the power of negative 2 l squared. So to find the inverse of the function to avoid confusion, we're just going to interchange, we're not going to interchange w and l. What we're going to do is solve for l in terms of w. So what will happen is magiging l is equal to blank. Dito w is equal to blank. Dito dapat magiging l is equal to blank. So first thing we're going to do para maganyan siya is kailangan natin i-transpose itong si l doon sa kabila, si w dito sa kabila. However, if you're going to transpose it, because there's no plus in here, there's no minus, ibig sabihin, kung may plus, kung walang plus minus dito, ibig sabihin, isang term lang yan sila. Isa, isa lang ito. So, kung dalhin mo to si L, L kailangan mong dalhin rin si 2 times 10 to the power of negative 2. So, what will happen is, if you transpose this, the positive will become negative. So, it will become negative 2 times 10 to the power of negative 2 L squared is equal to, transpose this one, it will become negative. Next, kailangan na L lang ang matira. So what you're going to do is, kailangan mo itong ikunin si 2 times 10 to the power of negative 2. If there's plus and minus in here, pwede mong i-transpose. However, because there's none, what you're going to do is, instead of addition property of equality, you're going to use the multiplication property of equality, or in simplest term, it's divide both sides by negative 2 times 10 to the power of negative 2, negative 2 times 10 to the power of negative 2. Kung anong katabi ni L squared, yun siya ang i-divide. So, ito siya, magiging makancel yan siya, matira na lang si L squared is equal to negative negative, magiging positive, 2 times 10 to the power of negative 2. So, paano mo kukunin si squared na kailangan na L lang natira? So, what you're going to do is square root. Ang kabaliktaran ng L ng squared pala is square root. So, square root mo dyan. Square root mo rin dito sa kabila. Cancel. Magiging L. So, if it is square root of 4, the answer is R positive negative 2. Kasi positive 2 times positive 2 is 4. Negative 2 times negative 2 is still 4. However, dito, ibig sabihin, positive negative ang answer. So, positive negative, square root of ganito. However, as you can see, L stands for lens. At walang negative na lens. Walang negative lahat, positive. So, what we're going to consider is only the positive. And that's also the reason why this is a function. 1 is to 1 function or 1 to 1 function. Because every value of L stands for one value of W. If there are two, if there are positive negative here, if there is positive negative here, it means that sa isang value ng L, dalawa, may positive, may negative. Pero ang consider lang natin is positive. So therefore, this is a, a one is to one function. So this is now the inverse. So the second question is, find the approximate length of a single fish if its weight is equal to 900 grams. 
as you could see in the first give in the first part of the sentence kailangan ng in kilograms so itong 900 grams gawin mo mo ng kilograms so what you're going to do here is you're just ang 900 grams i convert mo to, to kilogram so i move mo lang actually ng three decimal places magiging 0 0.9 kilogram yan siya so kung 0 0.9 kilogram yan we're just going to to substitute ang W magiging 0 0.9. Ito ang W magiging 0 0.9, 2 times 10 to the negative 2. Kopyahin mo lang lahat. Ang W palitan mo lang ng 0 0.9 substituted. So after substituting, you're going to solve this without calculator. That will be difficult. But if you're going to use calculator, the answer is... 6.71 and the lens is on meters so ibig sabihin kung 0 0.9 kilograms the lens is 6.71 meters and that's the answer